Previously on The Walking Dead. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. I only need a minute. Should have put you out of your misery right then. When I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. Here. Thanks. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. Everybody be cool. out there. Good work, Clem. Shit. Okay. Okay, we gotta do something, y'all. Pin down here. You can't just sit here and let this guy take pot shots at us until he runs out of ammo. Just let Kenny handle it. He's got it under control. Oh, was that what you call this? No. No, so someone's gotta go. We can't just sit here. This don't have to get any worse than it already is. You can just go! English, motherfucker! I kill every one of you! If I can just get over to that side of the wall, I can maybe get an angle on this guy. Cover me, alright? Just shoot over towards the woods. Yeah, okay. Good, good. I just need the distraction, okay? Alright, I'm not going. Я оставлю медленно тебя 
Safe to come out. Here, I got him. Jesus Christ. That was, uh, that was intense. I thought, man, eh, I thought that was it. Yeah, it was for these assholes. Thanks for coming back. I didn't know this man. I never killed someone that didn't wrong me in some way, that didn't deserve it. Tried to pretend he was a walker, but it's different. I didn't think it would be. You saved us. Yeah, that's why I did it, but it felt wrong. Are you sure about this? As sure as I'm gonna be. Let's go. How did this happen? She turned. Just like that. Clem spotted it first. Did what she had to to protect the child. This isn't your fault, okay? She just... She just lost too much blood. It ain't nobody's fault. You saved the boy's life. You know, we could have done better by her. She was just too far gone. She's with Alvin now. Yeah. Yeah, she is. Don't worry, Becca. We'll take care of your boy. You rest easy. You piece of shit! Ugh. Hey, hey! Stop! Guys, get guys, off me! Come on! It's over, man. He ain't a threat to us. How can you say that? Of course he is. Get out of the way! Whoa! What are you doing? I'm doing the same thing this asshole tried to do to us. It doesn't have to go down like that. Move out of the way, Mike. You... Clem, you, you don't mean that. Is it his house? Food? Please. Please, I can take you. Bullshit! No, no. It's true. We have place. Not far. Food. See? He wants to help. Oh, don't be stupid. He's just trying to save his skin. Why the hell would you help us, huh? I... I now want to see more people dead. Then close your eyes and I'll make it quick. Kenny, back off. If he's telling the truth, it could save all of us. He's lying. We can't trust him. It's worth the risk to check this place out. Trust him, don't trust him. It doesn't matter. We should go anyway. We just need to be careful. It can't be far from here. You stay out of this. You're the reason these fuckers came after us in the first place. Don't try and pin this on me. Lay off, Kenny. She just helped us. Look, don't start, all right? I'm sure you're real excited to have your girlfriend back. It doesn't matter why it happened. We have to move on. Think about the baby, Kenny. If there are supplies, we need them. We ain't gonna last much longer without more food. We gotta take a chance. Unless someone's got a better plan. <sighs> we got something to tie this shit bird up? Yeah, I got something. Follow me, I thank you. Just give me a reason. Yeah, man, he gets it. Look, I know you're probably pissed about me leaving. When I heard the gunshots, I... I knew it was a mistake. If it helps, the thing I'd normally do is walk away for good. But I didn't. Despite what my instincts are telling me. Despite everything I've seen. 
everything I've been through. I'm not pissed. I'm glad you're back. I didn't want you to go in the first place. Thanks. That's... that's good. Because you're probably 90% of the reason I came back. And it'd probably get pretty annoying if you hated me the whole time. Wouldn't want it to be annoying. No. That would suck. I'm gonna try to make this work. All I can do is promise you I won't abandon you again. Which, to be fair, I've never done before. Even though I probably should have. A few times now. You don't gotta point the gun at him the whole time. You forget what we just went through? He ain't going anywhere, Kenny. No need to get your arm all sore. I'm worried about Kenny. He's... He's in a dark place. We gotta keep an eye on him. Everything he's been through. That he's lost. It's changing him. So this is you making it work? You don't have to constantly be criticizing him. I'm not. I'm pointing it out. As a precaution. You're the only one that he trusts. That he really trusts. That means you're the one that's gonna have to pull him back. He's counting on you. If we're really going to make this work, we're all counting on you. I'll do my best. I know. Come on, slowpokes! No, no, I'm I'm fine. Okay, I just need a second. Sorry, I just I just put more weight on it than I should have. All right, wait there. Hey, what I say? When I tell you something, you fucking listen. You understand? Kenny, come on. There's no need for that. He's getting what he deserves. I'm fucking talking to you. I say stop. You'd best stop. He deserves it. He deserves to be treated like a human being. That's all I'm saying. After what he did, what happened back there was his fault. He lost all his people in one fell swoop. Ain't much we could do to him that'd be worse than that. Kenny, please, ease up on him. Just fucking stay put. I'm gonna have a word with Kenny. He doesn't have to treat him that way. Kid's been through enough. You all right here? Yeah, yeah. Uh, go on and talk to him. I got clam if I need anything. Okay. Here, just take the baby. Okay. What is it with you guys? What do you mean? Every man I've known is always trying to let each other know how tough they are. Put them in their place. Punch a dominant alpha male horse shit and it all ends the same way but don't look at me i ain't that guy oh that ain't true you get in your fair share of pissing matches too they're not all like that there are good men too my friend lee he was a good man well i wish i had had a chance to meet him me too i wish he was here now guess it took a woman to talk some sense into him Looks like Jane broke it up. Keep pressure on it, okay? I'm gonna go fetch some bandages. Hey, Bonnie. Yeah? I'm sorry. For what? I'll be right back. How are you feeling? If I'm being honest, uh, I've been better. How did we get here?
What do you mean? Sitting in the snow, leaned up against a tree, bullet in my leg. But alive. <laughs> when so many of my friends are dead, for no good reason, and I couldn't do anything to stop it. Everyone we set out with, just gone. Nick, Pete, Alvin and Becca, Carlos, Sarah, and for what? They didn't die in vain. I wish I could believe that. I could have done more, and that ain't up for debate. I know it in my bones, and I gotta live with it. All right, this should work. That's perfect. What'd I miss? Hmm? Uh, nothing much. You know, complaining, mostly. I was just mentioning how cold it is lately. Yeah. Good thing he got that cool jacket, huh? I'm sure most of that'll come out with a little soap and water. I'm fine. Hey, Clem. Go over and see if you can change the bandages on Kenny's wound. I offered, but I don't think he was comfortable with me doing it. But you know him better than I do. Maybe he'll let you do it. <sighs> okay. That a girl. That's gonna sting, but only for a second. It's gonna clean it. Oh, I know what it does. It's gonna suck. It's gotta get done. Go on. I was thinking we'd go with Alvin Jr. What do you think? Rebecca mentioned she'd like to name him Alvin if it was a boy. I mean, Rebecca was so out of it she hadn't settled on her name. Huh, yeah. I like it. Alvin Jr. it is. Do you like that? Well, I think AJ approves. What do you, uh, got there? Cause I think I'm alright. I mentioned it earlier. To Bonnie. Can I change your bandages? You shouldn't have to do stuff like this. Shouldn't have to do a lot of things. All right. Let's get it over with. Hopefully it don't scare this little guy. Or you. So how's it look? I still gonna be pretty when this heals? I'm glad Carver's dead. We saw to that, didn't we? So... I'm guessing this is gonna be the shitty part. So, this is gonna hurt like hell. Well, you could've lied a little, you know. <sighs> Holy fucking hell! <sighs> you need to stop squirming. Yeah. Yeah, okay. You're right. Sorry about the language, Junior. You're gonna be tougher than me when you're grown. I'm gonna expect you to be more of a gentleman than I am. But man, does that smart. He can hear a few bad words. I've heard plenty. Yeah, that shouldn't have been the case. You were right about me giving myself up. I can't believe I was willing to sacrifice Alvin just to hold out a little longer. We should have saved him sooner. Got him out of the camp. I'm gonna think about that every time I look at Alvin Jr. here. Alvin should be here, raising this boy. It should be him. Carver's the one who did it, not you. Yeah, I suppose. But I can't help but feel guilty. I'll 
done. Thank you, sweetie. Yep. Are we ready to go? Let's head out. Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you. What? It? it? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us. Arvo, we're not trying to be mean to you. We just want to know if this is where the supplies are. Is this the place you're taking us? Are the supplies here? No, it's at the house. It's still more work. Some more hours. God damn it. I knew this was gonna happen. This guy fucked us. Uh, thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. I think we should spend the night here, if it's safe. That's a big if. Well, there's a fence, which would help with walkers. Maybe. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. No, that's all you. Shh, it's okay. It's okay. You're a natural. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. Here, I got them. Come on over. It's safe. Today's my birthday. Near as I can tell, at least. Happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. So, that makes you... what? 27? That's... that's right. I'm surprised you remember. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork, waiting to collect. Probably. I hope I can go someday. Maybe when this is all over. I hope so too, Clem. I don't know. Just a waste of money. Well, the major in art history hasn't helped too much the last few years. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. Did get a minor in agriculture? keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion, and while it being your birthday and all, figure this is as good a time as any. Where did you get it? Bill kept all the alcohol in the armory. He didn't like people imbibing. What's that mean? Drinking. He, he didn't think people should drink. Feel a little guilty taking the first. Whoa, uh, wait! 
You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. We can't be too careful. The baby might be cold. Come on, Kenny. At least have a drink. Nah, maybe later. Clem, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. Thanks, Kenny. Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. I know. I know. I just... don't know what she's getting at all this. We're lucky to have her. I'm glad she's here. Well, she helped us back there. So that puts her as okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about her. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. It was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey. All right. All right, it wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said anything. It's my fault for bringing it up. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. Uh, yeah. Yes, yes. That, that is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now. The both of you. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. I don't know what to say to that. I don't know. Maybe she likes him? No, I think we could bet on that. Because you see here, Luke's a regular Casanova. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the ladies. Worked on me. <sighs> oh, shit. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry, it's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thoughts. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change their minds. At least we don't need to worry about being electrocuted. I've lost people too. We all have. I miss TV. Feels like forever since we had electricity. There, there, little guy. I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. Just, uh, 
needed some air. Kenny, there's air everywhere. I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there. After Sarita was... I just... I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. I mean, you did what you could. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. I'm so, so sorry. You don't have anything to apologize for. I know you didn't mean it. Thanks. I miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there a whole lot for a couple years. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Duck. To touch Conscious Face. I miss Duck too. He was a good friend. And I haven't had too many of them. He was a good boy. Pure. Just wanted folks to be happy, that's all. Boy like that. Thrown into a world like this. It's gonna be different with him. He's gonna get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. Ain't no sense in both of us being over here. I can handle watch on my own. The baby might be cold. Maybe you should bring him by the fire. Yeah, okay. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. It's probably been a while for everyone. Will it work? That depends. What is it? It's rum? Probably. I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to... You know. It'll only be weird if you make it weird. Just be cool. Hang out. I wish it was that easy. It is. People just love making it harder than it has to be. Why does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? That's really good. Have you had any? You want to sip? It's okay. No thanks. I'm trying to cut back. <laughs> you can be the designated driver then. Cool. But I don't know how to drive though. It's easier now. There aren't any cops. I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh. What was its name? Oh, it was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. I guess I was. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals. And I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. And it shattered into a thousand pieces all over the dining room. Sounds like a mess. Yeah, it was. Every couple years, someone would step on a piece of glass that didn't get swept up and get mad at me all over again. The problem with glass is, it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. Got grounded for six months. Holy shit. I haven't thought about that in a long time. I 
guess a deal's a deal. Here. Time to not make it weird. Want to sit here? No, that's... I'm fine. Oh, yeah, okay. Wherever you like. <laughs> uh, Jane... You don't have to justify that with a response. Hey, I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open. Less drama. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. <laughs> All right, enough of that. Hey, you Clem. It's nice to hear people laughing. Yeah, it is. You just spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah. We need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Hell yeah, it does. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Sounds like a waste of good rum. He lost his sister today. And whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to deal with. Trust me. I don't like it either, but we shouldn't let it ruin a nice night. I said my piece. I don't think that boy's a bad person. I just think good people do bad things sometimes. And they do it a lot more nowadays with the world being what it is. So, I think it's best Leave to... Leave me alone! Sorry, okay? My fault. I shouldn't have... Leave me alone! Please, Steve. It's okay. It's okay. She's in a better place. It's okay. It's okay. Maybe it's best if we all get some rest. Who knows how long a walk we got tomorrow. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll take first watch. Thank you, Kenny. Really? I, uh... Well, don't mention it. You did good. It was nice while it lasted. You sure you're good? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I, if I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, will you do that? It's no trouble. How much further? Close. Very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Come. I'm really starting to think <gasps> you're full of shit. It can't be much further. Kenny, look out! What the fuck? Ah! Ah! Kenny! Jesus Christ! That was close. Fucker came out of nowhere! That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Come. There. That piece of shit? It's half built. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. 
Fireplace. Very warm. Is there any other way to get there? Do we have to cross the lake? I should have stuck to the tree line. The fastest way between two things is a straight line. It's not far. Just be on the lookout. Maybe there's a way around. I don't see any. Say it in American, asshole. It's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. I go first. I can be front. Maybe we shouldn't clump together. We just can't have too much weight. She's right. We need to spread out, just to be safe. Less weight, the better. Let the Rusky go first, since he's so confident. It's okay. Okay, don't worry. We got some walkers behind us. And it's only a few of them. We should be all right. Let's just get to the house. Hey, stay with us. Fuck. That's two less to deal with. Just stay spread out and we'll be fine. Hey! Motherfucker! Shit! He's gonna kill him! Uh, Kenny! Get back here, you piece of shit! I should let you drown, you piece of shit! No! Kenny! Don't run! Well, they made it. Don't come over here. Okay, I can make it. It's it's fine. You sure? Yeah. You got walkers on the way. Let me help you. It's too you. thin for both of us. I just I just gotta be careful. Oh! Oh, no! Stop! Stop! I'm fine! I'm fine! No, you're not! I just gotta pull myself out! You need help, Lou! The ice is too thin! I got it! You need to help! No! Clem, you're gonna go! Fall through. Go help no, him! No, Clem, Clem, do not! Just go back for him! You're light! You Stop can do telling it. her that! Clem, look at me! Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time! Claim you can make it, but you need to go. Clementine, stop! Clementine! Just go back. Please. I got you. Please. Just go back. It's gonna be all right. I got you. No. I got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. You're gonna be okay. Go. To the house. We need a fire. Oh, fuck. She's gonna fucking freeze to death.
How the fuck did that happen? There's a fireplace. Jesus Christ. We have to get her warm. She's gonna freeze to death. Fish is gone. Luke's fucking gone. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. I tried to help him. I just... Once that I started to go, there wasn't nothing any of us could do. Clem tried to help him. He just... Oh, God. You son of a bitch! This is your fucking fault! Kenny, don't, man! Don't what? It's nobody's damn fault. And he has a point. This is crazy. Why? Because your friend here turned out to be a shitbag after all? He's just a scared kid. This ain't on him. Look at this place. Just a stack of fucking toothpicks. Bet those magical supplies are bullshit too. What? No speaking of English? Fuck you. You fucking commie piece of shit, Kenny! Fuck you. You mother! What the fuck, Ken? Let him go, Mike. Get the fuck off of me! What did you do to him? There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is gonna help How is baby? beating a kid to death gonna help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. I'm tying him up. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? He's hurt real bad. Mike! Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh... You got a light? I thought I had matches. Let me take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back, trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. You okay? Thank you. I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but it just hasn't felt this, this shitty in a while. He cared about you too, Jane. I know he did. God damn it. I shouldn't have come back. I knew this would happen. I knew it. Always does. Maybe not. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. 
I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth the crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up and be out of here by nightfall. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. Clem. Just be careful. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, all right? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. My daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean some bitch, but he taught me respect. Girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. I like her. Just give her some time. Maybe you're right. Hell, I didn't know what to make of Lee at first. Of course, he helped me and mine more times than I can remember. Jane helped us back on the road. All right, give it a turn. so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running, and then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's gotta be out there. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. Sounds good to me. We're gonna make it, Clem. I know it. All right, turn it again. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it! <laughs> 